matchup. Or even like a bunch of like two frames on, well, not even necessarily a two frame, just hitting Terry out of his up B if he like, fails to snap like with a dash attack or something silly like that. But uh, we'll see. DV definitely is going to be eating these combos for sure. I think Broly is going to be trying his best to space around the tilts as much as he can. I like that from Cerno, kind That's of trying right. to get away from King Dedede to slowly come back on the stage. Doesn't want to worry about those Gordos. Oh, close. Yep, you can get that down tilt in there. Oh nice. yeah, see, he did it early, but he, you see the idea he has going for there. Mm -hmm. Whoa. Kind of dropping a free punish there, but yep. Oh, wow, he went for a down smash. Yeah, with the shield drop frames, he can't really down smash that out of shield, even though it looks like it's really slow. But there's a big up smash covering both sides of DV and being relatively strong as well. Pretty good punish. Oh, straight yep, into DD's oh. mouth. Okay, he definitely wanted to just throw him off stage with that, but uh, he was able to mash out in time. Mm hmm. Christoph on Cerno, trying to get the call out there from the girdle. Trying to get the active frames of Burn Knuckle here, but he gets the jab, jab, power duck. Not enough there. 156. Oh, scary on the roll there. That would have been caught here, but there is the pot. There's yeah, the nice punish. Mm-hmm. Oh, toast, up air, good play. Usually okay. an opponent might try to panic air dodge or in those situations, just not really aware that up to up air can be a thing here for King Diddy at those percents. Oh, scary wow. smart. Like you said, yep. strides though. Almost having no end lag. Yeah, you, you might as well, like, Okay, the best way, to, in my opinion, to punish that is to try to hit him on his apex of it or when he's coming down before he hits the ground. Or just, like, literally wait for him to mash something after he lands with it. Mm -hmm. Like, this Terry and, like, most Terrys, they, they were just going to spot dodge after they land with it because they think you're going to try to punish it immediately. And since Terry has one of, like, he has an even better spot dodge cancel than other characters. Yeah. You can just flat out. You can just flat out spot dodge cancel like up to power rate guys. Oof. But it's almost. Not... Okay. Cerno almost caught the jump out of the shield. Great play there from the power geyser. Like you said, yep. barely any end leg from power dunk. Yeah, and uh, you can see Broly's respecting the fact that, you know. He can't immediately try to punish him on landing for that move, so he's just moving out of the way, waiting for him to throw something out. Yeah. Both characters pretty much at death percent. Nice, I like that play from Cerno. Trying to see if he can get the down tilt. Good jab, jab to a rising tackle here. Of course, King Dedede's weight will be the thing that falters him the most here. Nice DI. Nice. Have a power dunk here. 50% here. Good on Cerno to get the jump and the spike here. And another one to finish wow. the set. I'm sorry, not wow. even the set, just the game. That hitbox on down right looked very awkward. I don't think, you know, Broly Lee was expecting it to connect like that. But we'll take it. I'm going to keep it real with these strides. I did not even expect it to connect like that. Both both Cerno and Brody Lee just built different entirely. You didn't get the charge rising tackle, but still, that's really good damage already. Man, that power dunk going through Gordo and just like not trading whatsoever has been really helping out Sarno a lot. Yeah, this this is giving Brody Lee a little bit of his win for his money here. Wow, one hundred four percent already. Nice, gets the cross up here, down tilt a burning knuckle. Waits for the play from the Gordo. Can he catch the get up? Yep, there it is. Kind of surprising to see the charge rising tackle after he got those two jabs to work. Ooh. 
only 23%. Yeah, Brody Lee, at this point, would really oh, try to look for an edge guard here, but oh my god, taking so much damage already. Nice, good grab. Up throw. No, doesn't get the rising tackle. Brutally probably DI'ing to get away from that. Sorry, not up throw. I mentioned down throw. Down throw, up air, rising tackles. Usually Terry's bread and butter when he gets those throws. The forward throw. Screeds that opportunity with the back air. Great placement here. Cerno looking for those empty hops. See if he can call out Brody Lee. Oh, he dropped shield early. Got tagged by that power dunk. Ugh, tough spot. Good power wave to catch that one. Up air, rising tackle, yep. Yeah. King Diddy great. is big, a big penguin. Oh yeah, Cerno is just has so much confidence in his matchup already. Solid patience. Oh. But and yeah, and it'll pay got, off. He didn't die, but he got super Terry Drear. The, the Terry classic, which is roll into you, auto turnaround nonsense to tilt move. Ooh! That's super. <laughs> auto turnaround down tilt into up tilt power geyser. Feels terrible, but <laughs> we'll take it with the three stock. I'm I don't sorry. Know. I don't that know. was nasty. That was disgusting to see. Jesus. Yeah, the thing there, like you could tell Brody was like, all right, I just, I just want to roll away to get away from this Terry pressure, but... Terry's like, nah, I don't care where you're rolling, where you, where you think you're crossing up. You can't actually cross me up. I'm just going to down tilt you, automatically turn around, and, uh, you know, get this combo. We might be getting some Terry nerfs, man, on that Steve patch, man. Who knows? Who knows? Nah, they don't need to nerf Terry. I feel like his weaknesses make up for... His power. strengths, yeah. Is. Doesn't auto snap the ledge. His recovery is pretty exploitable. Yeah, Sarno knows like the the amount of in life this move has is not existent, so I might as well just keep using it. Like the way he does it there, he like lands right in front of Didi and so immediately he's able to just press buttons on his shield. Yeah, and it basically ignores the Gordo and it stops Brody yep. Lee from going for aerials. Yeah, it's very hard to position the Gordo to actually catch him for jumping in that arc of his like, like look at that. Arc. Like right there, he just <laughs> Yeah, look at that. Oh, he thought he could roll away now, fam. Come and get this auto turn around. Oh, cancelled? It's okay, man. I can yeah. jab afterwards. Jesus. Yeah. Broly Lee recognizing that, you know, he's just going to keep applying pressure. He's going to roll out of the jabs, but it doesn't even matter. He just keeps power dunking all day. He's going to keep doing it because it's working. Broly Lee has not really punched it that hard, so there's no real reason yeah. for uh, Cerno to change it up. Good stuff from Broly Lee. He got the inhale. He blew him out. Trying to see how Cerno was going to react to that one. Finally, Broly Lee with a little bit of breathing space. No ob tilt. Looking for the back air. Yup. Using those jumps to stall it. Watch out. Really still has the game plan and set. He missed the back air. Great grab. Oh, he actually grabbing his landing out of the power dunk this time. Ooh, good play, oh, good play, nice. good play. Yep. Br brilliant play to punish the spot dodge that Sergeant has been doing pretty much every time. Use the lingering hitbox to cover it. Exactly. Nice. Looking for the reaction. Gets the Gordo play. Oh, I'm Oof. surprised the grab didn't come out, but he's living just by a thread there. How can you grab, man, when this Terry is all in the shield? Nice. Oh, good, oh, good oh, anti air, finally. Broly, wow, a little bit breathing from here. Anti the power dunk, the startup of the power dunk. That was actually so good. Write that down, folks. Write that down. You can anti-air the start of power dunk. Anti-air. Take notes. Take notes. I may not even know if it's true, man, but you know what? Brody Lee found a way. Oh, yeah. The Brody Lee has all the momentum right now. Okay. Still living. Big boy D. Gonna eat that power dunk. 
Hold oh, the starting frames of dash attack. Oh, good upper, good upper. Such a great extending hitbox. Sees that Cerno is right there grabbing the ledge. Power dunk. Yep, that'll probably do it. No, yeah. Yeah, just barely, just barely. But he's taking 109%. Luckily, he does have the go meter, so he can make a comeback happen. But I'm not sure if Broly Lee's going to let it happen right now. Ooh, big catch with the Gordo. Still alive, but every recovery here. Nice. Air to the ledge, but gets trapped by another <laughs> Gordo. And uh, yeah, that's all it takes. Broly Lee finally getting a game on the board. Yeah, it took a little bit. I'm definitely because Brody Lee is on the receiving end of all this big hurt box. T Terry can just be all around you here, but finally Brody has found a way, and I think it kind of started all with the anti air on that power dunk. Kind of gave Brody a little bit of hope there, especially when he was able to get consistent Gordos and then still understanding, okay, my back air, if I use my jumps, it's going to be hard for Sunil to still react to it. All right, here we'll finally Brody Lee with the point on the board. Cerno is at set point. 2 1 here in Cerno's favor. Let's see if Brody Lee can find another way to come back. Will Cerno take it all home into grand finals? Okay. So let's see how this FD picks works out here for Cerno. Oh, mm. Missing the pivot grab? Up air, uh, yep, and that's gonna be pretty true on King Diddy with his weight. Yeah. And big hurt box. Oh, nice. Forcing Cerno to hold the shield or go for an option where he gets hit by Gordo. Okay, nice. Up smash out shield from the parry. Yep. Oh, oh. missed it. Could have died since he got sent off stage for missing that power dump. Oh. Yep. Brody Lee, pretty good on that opportunity. Stop Cerno from getting another power dunk in the air. 151 here. Of course, this is a big penguin. Good rollback. Oh. Able to get through. Oh, this is the all the pressure. I'm oh, sorry. my God. The steel pressure was way too strong there. The fact that he power dunked through the Gordo, like, and send it right back on his shield, then was able to just immediately press buttons on landing because that's no landing lag. Very, very good block string there for my uh, Cerno. Okay. Yeah. Oh my gosh, what a tech chase. Yeah, Broly Lee is just really having a difficult time King is uh, Gordo Sips to work. Nice. Okay. Time around right. the power dunk. Oh. Ooh, okay. close, I like close. the crack shoot. Great use of the crack shoot to get to the ledge. Very, very close to losing his stock there. But there's. The whip punish with the input power dunk, just adding the extra knockback, that's all he needed. Oh, oh. what a catch. Yeah, that roll, that roll, kind of cost it there from Cerno. But still able to come back with the power dunk. A power geyser even oh, gets the Gordo as well here. Anti-air, yeah, yeah. He's oh, this is it. This is fly, it. Because he does not care, man. Once you're at that range where you can just let those supers go you have to stock lead and they're a big body like they're definitely gonna get tagged by that